Continuing our coverage surrounding DeKalb County's sole candidate for school superintendent, we're talking about Dr. Devon Horton, and tonight we are hearing from the president of the Georgia Federation of Teachers who feels district officials are not being upfront with its selection process. Dr. Horton's selection was announced last week, and since then, 11 Alive has learned he has tied to a federal civil rights lawsuit with his last school district in a Chicago suburb. Dr. Horton was presented last night during a town hall meeting at Shambly High School, and Georgia's Federation of Teachers President Verdalia Turner says that the event was a way to make the public feel like they were part of the process. All of us are stakeholders, but some of us have more influence than others. So it's a way of civilly controlling people so they will feel like they are part of the democratic process. Uh, it's an exercise in futility. All right, so here's what's next. Uh, DeKalb County has one more public event scheduled for Dr. Horton. That's going to be tomorrow from 6 to 8 p.m. at the school district headquarters on Mountain Industrial Boulevard in Stone Mountain. We have a lot more on the debate over the county's vacancy online on 11alive.com.